right, Mick. Bring the weather on, man. Come on. I miss you. Bye-bye. Oh, I miss you more. That was a nice one, wasn't it? All right, clouds will start to take over later tonight and into tomorrow. I've looked at clouds from both sides now. There was a song about the clouds, wasn't there? Some sun Saturday, and then the bottom falls out late Saturday night, even into the dawn hours there. All right, uh, as far as the cloud cover, like I said earlier, we'll be mostly quiet as we go through the night. A few more clouds out there. More will move in for tomorrow. So you still might have a chance to see some of those Gemini meteor showers. Look in the northeast skies. There'll be a few more clouds out there than there were last night, but you might catch a couple of them. A few flurries flying across the lake, so we may see one or two tonight, but I'm telling you, that's about it. Here's what we're looking for for Saturday night into Sunday. This thing right here, that'll make a beeline right for New York State. We'll have different types of precipitation, and then we're keeping our eye on another storm that's going to form oh, right about down there and come up the coast. And that could bring us some significant snow showers. However, once again, the computer models are disagreeing. Some have it blowing out to sea, other ones having it right into New York State. So we'll have uh, more of a fine tune on that later on. All right, we're at 36 degrees out there. Winds out of the northwest at 6, wind chill 31. Humidity's pretty high, 70%, and the barometer is falling. Here's your almanac. Our friends of the National Weather Service says it was 43 degrees up there today, 26 for last night's low. We're still above average, 34 and 22. This is interesting. 55 degrees was the high in 2006, and then a year later in 2005, it was the record low, minus 6 degrees. And uh, the sun goes down one minute earlier, or later, I'm sorry, excuse me, 4.33. Last night it was 4.32. So we're making some headway on that. As far as uh, right now, we've got Rochester 39 lookalikes in Buffalo, New York. 42 over there in Albany. They'll get some cold air later on tonight. Who do you know at Bodie State Park? where they woke up to minus 14 degrees. They're pretty much right on the line of Nevada and California at the foothills of the uh, Sahara Nevadas. There's part of them right there. It's a ghost town now. But it was cold there this morning, and this forecast is dedicated to anyone who ever saw Mommy kissing Mrs. Claus. And we'll take it from there. Partly cloudy skies, maybe a flurry or two, and it's going to be cold, 26. For tomorrow, partly sunny, a bit cooler, 39 we'll go down to. And tomorrow night, a chance of light rain and wet snow, less than an inch, though, so not too bad. 28 degrees, and here's your five-day. Everyone said amen. Sunday looks miserable out there. Rain, sleet, freezing rain, wet snow, 38, 30. Monday, mild enough for all rain, 44. Tuesday, same thing, light rain, 38. Possible flurry at night as the temperatures start to go down. And Wednesday, temperatures falling, rain and wet snow, 35 and 29. And like I said, next Wednesday, this may all change. We're going to check on the computer models. We could get some significant snowfall by Wednesday, but you be careful out there, guys and dolls.